Hello everyone! Today we are going to open up Magic again. Whew, that's been a long time. And this was also part of the birthday special thingy. Um, yeah, Magic Arena Starter Kit. Now, I was under the impression that Arena is digital. So what is this then? Um, two two-player decks. Uh, we have a Magic Play Guide, a code for Arena. So that's probably uh, what the starter deck means. And we're going to take a look at this. I have not heard of this because I've been out of the loop for Magic for a while now. Um, so yeah, let's take a look what this is. We have two deck boxes here. We have uh, the playing guide, which is basically just a rule booklet, I think. Yeah. And we have a ready to play thing. And two decks. All right. Oh, okay. So we have two um, foil cards in here. We have, uh, first of all, Vito, the Thorn of the Dusk Rose, which is a three mana. Uh, one three it's from m21 i don't have any cards from that set yet uh whenever you gain life target opponent loses that much life and then for five mana creatures you control gain life link until end of turn all right for the green card it's an ikoria card um that's also a set i don't have anything of but i don't miss ikoria anyway uh kogla the titan ape uh, six mana seven six when it enters the battlefield, it fights up to a one target creature you don't control. Then when uh, Ogla attacks, uh, destroy target artifact or enchantment uh, defending player controls. Then for two, you can return a human you control to its owner's hand. Kogla gains indestructible until end of turn. All right. Now then, let's take a look at what we get. Two decks. Um, yeah, first of all, let's take a look here at the black deck. Uh, where? Oh, there it is. So, we start off here with the Demon of Loathing. Um, oh, that's from uh, Theros. Nice. Uh, so, it's a 7 mana card. 7-7. Uh, seven, seven. Flying and Trample, and whenever a uh, Demon of Loathing deals combat damage to a player, that player sacrifices a creature. Then from M21, um, Demonic Embrace, it's an Aura, for 3, Enchant Creature. Um, then it gets plus 3, plus 1, Flying, and is a Demon in addition to its other types. And you may cast demon, uh, Demonic Embrace from your graveyard by paying 3 life and discarding a card in addition to its other costs. Peer into the Abyss uh, for 7 mana, a sorcery. Target player draws cards equal to half the number of cards in their library and loses half their life. Round up each time. Wow. Okay. Uh, Underworld Sentinel uh, for 5 mana. It's a 4-5. Uh, whenever Underworld Sentinel attacks, exile target uh, creature card from your graveyard. When Underworld Sentinel dies, put all cards exiled with it in, onto the battlefield. And then we have some commons. Uh, we have a Blood Glutton, a Fetid Imp, Finishing Blow, Gloom Pangolin, Gormand, Grasp of Darkness. Lost Legion, Serrated Scorpion, Skeleton Archer, uh, Unlikely Aid, Walking Corpse, and then we have uh, M21 Swamps, and they're just swamps, and quite a lot of them actually. Right, now, that's that code, and... Uh, some reminder on, a, on some cards. All right, so um, that's a black deck. And I like that they put uh, Theros cards in there. They are um, outside of the set. And I think 
they are the ones that they actually put in those uh, color boosters. Right, for green we have a Colossification for 7. Enchant creature, um, and when it enters the battlefield, tap Enchanted creature. Enchanted creature gets plus 20, plus 20. Wow, for 7, it's pretty insane. Iron Skill Hydra, also one of those cards um, in the color specific packs. It's outside of the set, so that's good. I don't have these yet. Iron Skill Hydra for 5 mana is a 5-5, five, five, and if a creature would deal damage, uh, deal combat damage to Iron Skill Hydra, prevent that damage and put a plus 1 plus 1 counter on Iron Skill Hydra. Tree Shaker Chimera, also one of those cards. It's a 7 mana 8-5, and all creatures able to block Tree Shaker Chimera do so. Uh, when it dies, draw 3 cards. Then we have Yorvo, the Lord of Garenbrig, for 3 mana, it's a 0-0, zero, zero, and when it enters the battlefield, put 4 plus 1 plus 1 counters on it. Whenever another green creature enters uh, the battlefield under your control, put a plus 1 plus 1 counter on uh, Yorvo. Then if that creature's power is greater than Yorvo's power, put in another plus 1 plus 1 cre uh, counter on Yorvo. And then again, we have some uh, commons here, uh, the almighty Brushwag. Just like one of those older cards that depicted the Brushwag. Just a ball of thorns. Uh, bristling Boar. We have a Colossal Drapmaw, of course. Honey Mammoth. A Humble Naturalist. The Hyrex Tower Scout. A Lenoir Visionary. Plummet. Ram Through. Snare Spinner. Titanic Growth and a whole bunch of forests and another one of these cards so yeah apparently if you um, enter the code for arena you'll get these two decks which isn't too bad could have been worse and um, yeah seems like they're decent enough cards probably not game breaking but still a fun deck so yeah Thank you all for watching. There will be more magic in the future again. Some, uh, some decks that I got. So, uh, yeah. Looking forward to it. See you all later. Bye-bye.